This is called Friday the 13th. Any day can be the lucky one, or the one with your number written all over it. One, two, three, five, oh, seven. In the poet's case, walking out the front door of the penitentiary, 8.30 p.m., 39 years ago this December. Three times 13 years, a cycle of struggle to make it through in one piece, on the yard or in these streets. Anyone who can pick up a frying pan owns death, Burroughs said. And sometime in New York City, coming home from the recording studio, walking up to his front door, John Lennon with a gun stuck in his face. Oh, Oh, sweet giant of song, with heart of huge dimension and eyes deep in the sky, there has to be a day when each of us must pass beyond this tedious sphere to enter some wondrous place of which we do not know whether we're ready or not some other place or space out of time where no punk with a weapon will ever press you again or blow off your face out of the depths of his madness. No one will hold us against our will in a cell with bars in front and back, six feet by four feet by eight feet high. No one will take us out of our natural lives and send us away from here by means of some murderous fantasy in which we are denied everything we have lived for. Oh, please let us die at the end of our own time and not before. Free in our world of strife, let us have life as long as we can. And please, let there be men like Monk and John Lennon to share of their hearts and light up our ways as long as we may live. Man, yeah. <laughs> Thought yeah. that might contribute to the dialogue. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>